guys, it's Fall Fanatic, and in this video I'm going to be showing you guys how I made my PvE food build. So basically this build is a little bit like the um, PvP version, except I use it in PvP. Um, by the way guys, subscribe and uh, keep worshipping the Mothman cult. Continue worshipping the Mothman cult, Mothman will very much be appreciative to you. <laughs> And he will even be even more appreciative and bless you with a um, three-star bloodied explosive, twenty-five uh, percent reload uh, mini gun tomorrow in Fallout 76. If you subscribe, anyway. So um, in this build, I use Nuka Colas, um, not just normal food, but Nuka Colas. Um, the reason why I use these is because these actually have some pretty decent healing rates already without the perks on. Um, so as you can see, I've got quite a few on me, and later in this video I'm going to show you a few places where you can go ahead and get some, and places where you can actually craft some yourself, or even farm a little bit of them. Um, as you can see, Nuka Quantum is very powerful, but things like Nuka Quantum can be made even more powerful using the perk Cola Nut, which at its full length makes Nuka Cola products three times more beneficial. Obviously, that's like a really nice perk to have when you're using this kind of build. Now, there's one other perk you need to use for this kind of build, and that's through Hiker, because Nuka Colas actually end up weighing about one each, but with through Hiker, they end up weighing uh, about 0.1. So that's um, your upside on through Hiker. Once again, some people don't like to run it just because, but I like to run it at least one rank on most of my characters, because it, it even lessens down the weight of. Um, purified water. So let's go ahead and I'm going to kind of show you guys exactly how much it heals. So if you're using a base nuke cola, which I only use base nuke colas when I'm passively healing, um, you're going to just want to pop those. And they're a little bit slow, but the thing that um, nuke colas do is they have a much, much, much longer time of effect, especially with the three times thing on. So they're just going to, um, you're just going to be practically invincible for like, with the nuka cherry, it's probably like three to four seconds and as you can see it does some decent healing power um, with the quantum it heals quick it heals quite a lot and it stay and you stay immune to like pretty much all bullets for a while but with the cherry as you can see it's probably like in the middle of the nuka cola and the nuka quantum so i use it as more of a like not passive healing but more of like uh, not so like very needed situation healing. Um, so obviously when I'm popping the nuke quantum, you can see I literally am just invincible for like a long time, especially with this three times benefit thing on. On I am literally benefit, like literally invincible. I literally ran out of a clip before I could actually kill myself. So it's obviously very powerful to use this uh, nuke quantum in a big fight, um, boss fights especially. Um, this is actually a sneak build, by the way, um, so it doesn't actually use power armor, so that means you're vulnerable to getting uh, crippled, so that's why I always carry a few stim packs on me all the time. So now I'm going to go ahead and go into a few methods on how you can get your own big amount of Nuka Colas. Here we go. Let's go ahead and do this. Alright, so the first method that I know of is um, going to buy them from if you have the companion Beckett. Now right now Beckett does not have any on him right now, but if you buy them from the companion Beckett, he will sell them to you and you can buy them for pretty cheap. Um, another way you can go ahead and get them is getting going through the Wastelanders quest line to go ahead and craft them inside the chemistry bench. I think it's the chemistry bench might be cooking. Um, I'm trying to think if there's any other ways that I know of. There is actually one other way that I know of. Uh, one place that I always go to um, get Nuka Cola um, is White Springs. You might think, well, that's kind of, there's only one Nuka Cola spawn there. Yes, but I go there and farm all the time. So, oh my gosh, Beckett just threw himself off. D did anyone else see that? What? Alright, replay time, replay time. Here we go. Uh.
Okay, so that was just the weirdest thing ever. Um, okay, anyway, I wanted to show you guys the spot at White Springs where I usually... Oh, jeez, there's two quantums here this time. Okay, well, there's two quantums here, so... Yeah, that just proves how good this place is. Another good place is um, at the uh, uh, Tyler County Fairgrounds. You can go ahead and go farm there. Um, I think that's going to about wrap up this video, guys. I hope you like my PvE food build um, that is revolved around Nuka Cola. Okay, I'm going to go ahead in this video. I'll see you in the next one. Remember to like and subscribe.